on that, dude. Wait, what? Alright, you know what, guys? So, I was just, I just want to build with you guys. Because I want to take you on a little tour about how I build stuff. And no, I don't mean, like, copy me. I don't, like, don't, just, like, don't copy, bro. I'm saying, I'm saying that. So yeah, guys. So you're only show you what we're gonna be doing. So uh, here's what I'm gonna be doing. So as you see here, this is my nice little garden. I was talking about something until my my iPad died like twice today. So my series got ruined a bit. So here's what we're gonna be talking about. So once everything loads in, we're gonna be talking about this. And I don't want anyone copying. Please don't. Okay, that's my only like thing. Like, like you can copy some of my stuff. I can copy like the colors. Yeah, how about that? I'll let you guys copy the colors. That's the only thing I do fine, fine. Copy the colors. I don't mind. Now, if you want to give it life, you can give it this color. If you want to give it too much life, you can give it that color. If you want to give it dead, or if you just want to give it a little healthier green, you can do that. But you can already see what the original color is supposed to be. Because as you can see here, this one's shaped in that color. Meaning that's supposed to be that color to begin with. So I don't know if I retextured it or not. So you can like you can see like the little linen, not linen, but like the architecture green or whatever. I don't know what it's called, guys. Okay. But then, but then again, guys, this is a little too green. But then again, if you do like that green, which I hate, I don't like that color really. But then again, this green feels like it's like out of a like a scene from a movie. I don't, I don't know. So I'll say go with moss. Because moss isn't, like, too, like, populated. Because you don't want stuff like the brightest color ever. That's, like, me, like, going to, like, a brick wall and just, like, doing this to it. Here's, here's, what, here's what you don't want to do. You don't want to just make it the brightest red ever. You want to make it, like, either the darkest or the second brightest. It's, like, you want to go here, and that doesn't look as bad. But still as bad. And this doesn't look bad either. So you either, you want to go to the second... Or you just want to go, you want to stay away from, like, all these colors up here. The only color that you do want to keep is, like, either this one or this one. The medium red is, like, the medium. This one's a bit odd. It's, like, pink. So, now, you want to go with sand red. Sand red's okay. Copper is okay. Rust, rust is good, too. Medium red's, like, yeah, it's a little bit pinkish, too. Terracotta's fine. Tawny is fine. Brunt is fine. This is not fine. That's okay. Well, it's actually fine, too. This is fine. This is, like, really fine. Actually, it's pretty nice. Don't, this is, like, not okay. That's still... That's a little bit okay. It's, like, a better than the first one, but no. That's, that's fine. And that's also fine. Yeah, but that's just some... This one just for trying to recommend you with the guy, the guys with the color guide. That's the color guide, guys. So I hope everyone follows the color guide I gave you. So like, here's what I'm trying to think of though right what the heck oh my bro that's way too huge that's like a that's like an actual like human size like now here's what i'm just trying to say you guys i just want a nice little thing like this is just like a nice little chilling area it's nothing more than a chilling area either see you guys you don't want to exaggerate stuff too much I guess what I'm trying to say here is you don't want to add, like, a fancy, like, gallery, like, painting. And then you want to add, like, a giant skeleton in there. Like, no, you don't add that kind of stuff. That That's just, like, stupid. 
And then you'd be like, bro, why don't you have windows on your walls? First of all, I just made this wall. Second of all, it could be there. You know why it could be there? What kitchen needs windows in it? No kitchen in the world ha needs to have windows in it. The only kitchen in the world that needs to have windows are the ones that are on fire. That way some smoke can get out. I mean, I guess. I mean, I don't know if that works, really. Next topic, guys, I think we should talk about. I mean, I think I, I got it down with the color choice. Just don't go, like, too crazy on your colors. Like, if, if you can afford moss, which you, like, most likely can, then just use it. Like, don't use anything else. Like, for instance, you don't need to do anything else, really. And then you be like, oh, what do you gotta do with your backyard, dude? You're gonna need to do something. Okay, guys, so you may be like, oh, okay, what, am, what is he gonna do with his backyard? And I think I wanna be, d d play this, like, simply cool. First things you wanna do is pretty simple. You wanna either populate it or you wanna make it look ugly. Up to you guys. Now, the first thing I would recommend is gather as much, much money as you can. Actually, I'm not really an expert at this stuff. I just make up random stuff as I go along. Oh. Yeah, I'm actually not even joking, bro. I kind of do. I just exaggerate stuff to the point. So, wh what do we do with our yard, though? Because you most likely have all this extra space, and you don't know what to do with it. Uh, first things first. Let's see all this stuff. First thing I can say right off the bat is don't buy anything too expensive first. Because you can save your money a bit. Now, you might need to buy some trees, which are expensive, but, like, it's worth it. That's all I got to say about the trees. So make sure you're getting the trees. And make sure you know where your yard's starting from. And make sure everything's even. So, for instance, this is, like, a three pixel. And that's, like, a four pixel. Meaning that you're going to need to move this somewhere in between here. Now, is this even? I don't know. Both of them are three pixels, and both of them are half slabs. Meaning that this is even. So now, what do you do from here? Now, since I'm not really an expert at building too much, I just build mansions, okay? It's like a curse. But just because I can build mansions does not mean I can build the inside. Okay? It doesn't mean that I can build the outside or inside. It just means I can decorate mansions from the outside really nicely. Does it mean I can, like, build a proper, like, outside? Or, like, like, out exterior or something like that? Like, no, it doesn't mean that at all. Here's what it does mean, though. First of all, you want to go and get in the, the hardest mode ever. A.K.A. that mode that I'm in. And you simply just want to start by, um... Hmm, what, what do we do? I'm, like, really thinking of what to do. So, do you add mushrooms? I don't know. I don't know if you would add mushrooms or not. Well, let me think about this. Just start up basic, guys. Like, just start up, like, a little birdhouse. Like, a little fountain. Like, maybe you got a birdhouse right next door. I don't know. That, that would, is that weird? You want to get out of here real quick. Face it the right way. Make sure it's not going inside of it, though, dummies. Now, you have to also remember, guys, it has to look nice from a distance, too. Like, it can't just be, like, a one-side nice thing. No, this will look nice from the side, but, like, there's no entrance anyway, so... I don't really know why it has to be nice from this angle anyway. Also, I just kind of randomized stuff. But yeah, let me just show you, like, how you should do it. So, first things first. If you want to go for an outdoor look, just start off basic. 
and basic to me is a little bit expensive to you guys it's expensive to me too don't worry but like some of you guys you're using like the cheapest furniture ever and yeah i used to do that until one day i just like snapped in my head i can do so much better in Bloxburg. and that actually was like a like a month ago <laughs> <laughs> now that I realize that, it looks so much better. Like, now, after realizing that, everything looks so much better. Like, here, here's what it used to look like back then. What's, what's the example? I just fixed it. Wait, did I actually fix everything? I think I actually fixed everything. There's, like, no other way of, like, oh, yeah, here's an example, I guess. So back then, I had this, like, really cheap office setup. I used the cheapest computer. I never used the most expensive. I used cheap, the cheapest chairs, the cheapest everything. I even used the cheapest, like, tables. Cheapest beds. I used the cheapest, um, stuff. I used the cheapest everything at that rate. Like, everything I used was cheap. The only time I wasn't cheap was probably here. But that was only for, for like, for, for like, because that was for me. So tip number one is just stop being cheap, you dummies. That's the best advice I can give anyone. Just don't be cheap. And don't be crazily cheap either. Because that's just pure insanity if you're really crazily cheap. Wait, like, you, you never should be cheap to begin with. Also, what is this mode that I'm in? Like, I'm stuck in, like, some kind of weird mode. Dang it, I meant to delete that thing. Dang, bro, dang. I accidentally deleted the wrong thing. So, of course, guys, and generally speaking, be more careful, too. And also, my phone just died, so we're gonna have to be even more careful. No, I just unplugged my iPad because it's so hot. Of course, some people don't understand that in my life. Oh gosh. In case you don't know what I'm saying, I won't tell you either. How spooky. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Here's a new idea though. Take different approaches, like add sunflowers, but no, that's too expensive for now. So, like, you may be like, bro, what are you trying to do here? It's actually kind of hard to explain. But I want to buy this because it's way bigger. Now you may be like, bro, this is just block of, blocking the sunlight. And yeah, maybe that, that will be true, I guess. And while that is true... You can't... You, I will not deny it. It is true. Don't be afraid to combine stuff together because you can. Yeah, you heard me, guys. Combine stuff together. Now, is it strange? A little bit. But we're going to move this a bit, okay? Now, I know these tips may seem like, oh, this is, like, so useless, dude. What am I ever going to use this for? You'll probably see. I don't know. But in order for me to tell you what you're going to use this for, it's going to be pretty simple. You're going to use this actually for something really good in the future. So what you're going to use this space for is pretty simple. So I want you to use the first thing you got to do. First thing you're going to do, guys, is you're going to make sure you have something good. Okay, so first thing I will confirm to you guys. Don't just, like, start buying these. Like, first thing you should actually do, you should sell the floor next to it. And after that, you should quickly replace 
replace it. Put a tiny little fence around it, okay? Uh, I mean tiny. Like, I don't mean, like, put... Uh, here's, what I, here's, here's the opposite of what I meant. Don't put a whole entire tiny fence around it, okay? Put a tiny actual little fence around it. Now, what, what may I consider tiny, guys? Anything ranging from here is considered tiny. But, like, make sure it looks great whenever it, like, goes, like, through it. Because it's going to go through the pillars. So make sure it also looks great whenever it's going through the pillars. So that means that we're going to have another better fence, a.k.a. this. This fence will look better whenever it's going through the pillars, right? Because I can see that nothing looks really odd about it. But one problem, though. We're going to have to move this a bit. Now, does this look odd again? I don't know. Is this off by a center? You have to ask yourself questions, guys, I swear. Now, as you can see here, everything looks perfectly fine. You don't have really a large fence at all. So nothing looks, like, ridiculous. Everything looks kind of basic and simple. Right? You'd be like, bro, okay, like, now what are we doing? So I guess a simple thing to say here is what you're doing is pretty simple. Okay? So what you want to do from here now is you want to take it out whatever, like, you want and place whatever, like, garden material you want to use. And for me, I'm going to use an example of a sunflower. Now, you can plant many of these. You can plant, like, a few. Also, remember, there's sunflowers. So whatever way the sun is facing in blocks, but put them that way. Just so you can be more accurate. So if the sun's facing that way, put it that way. If the sun's facing this way, this way, or this way, put it that way. Of course, I don't know which way the sun's facing. Now, my iPad may die. Because it's, like, don't be the third time that my iPad dies. Especially on video. Or anywhere else. Since it, you know it's an iPad Pro. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. But before we actually do that, anything like that, you do want to add a little bit more of a simpler thing. Say you want, like, to get in. What are you doing? You're going to need a little bit of a 2x2 two two path. So by making this 2x2 two two path, you get access to it. And, I don't know, it just gives it a little bit more life. Now, what do you guys think about my new little bit of, a, of an expansion? I mean, it looks okay. Like, yeah, I don't, I don't expect my stuff to look nice all the time. But I do f come back in the future. And I do fix it. It's like, it's like future me, like, comes back to the past. And just, like, like revives it. So basically, whenever something's too ugly, I'm just like, oh my gosh, dude, I gotta fix this one day. I'll, I'll fix it eventually. And yeah, it looks like we actually have enough to actually do it. So we can actually have enough to fix it. Now, another tip, guys, is don't use ugly blocks. Like, this is ugly. This is ugly. This is ugly, bro. That's like a, that's like a brick, for, like, for a wall. Also, make sure to charge your iPad. So fine, I'm gonna I'm gonna risk I'm gonna ris take a risk with my iPad and plug it back in. Let's hope nothing bad actually happens. And I just heard it unplug, so it's not gonna fool me again. I can't have it dying on video again, bro. I swear. So don't use that. Also, yeah, I'm, like I need to use like good examples. Don't use something like this for outside. That sucks. Here's here's the materials you do use. You use this. You can use that. You, no, don't use that. Use that. You can use this. You can even sometimes use that. I don't know. You can use this. Well, I don't know about this. This is like all concrete or like plaster. Concrete. And it's even called plaster. I don't know about this either, but it doesn't actually seem too bad. But I wouldn't recommend it. Most recommend is like stone materials. For like walkways. Like this one's my favorite though. I'm like... Dang it, I almost like made my, my whole entire floor like grass. Close one. Now as you can see, it gives it a nicer a vibe. 
Now, as you can see, I'm completely out of money. I'm not even joking, bro. So, what do we do? We maybe go, like, oh, just sell something. No, nah, bro. Selling is a little too much. Especially something like limited edition. You don't sell stuff like that. Stuff you do sell, though, is stuff you don't need. So, like, this gates. Don't need them. Oh, yeah, and they also were money-consuming, too, so... Might as well. So it can help me finish off something really beautiful. So, yeah, it's worth selling something like that. Then you be like, bro, okay, well, now that you did that, now what are we doing? Whoa, dude, that's a little too big. I didn't mean to actually get that. What I meant to get was... Wait, where is it now? Now, this one's actually a little too big. Now you may be like, bro, what do we do now? Well, since you have it too big, just shrink it a bit. Make sure it's the right size, though, whenever you're shrinking. Also, make sure it's the right size whenever you're, like, regrowing it back. Now, of course, guys, I don't have enough money. So, I'm like, bro, what do we do with this now? Sell it immediately. Because it's getting in your way, obviously. It's the next thing you want to do. You know, let me just sell something real quick that I don't need. Trees, they're a little bit useless for now. So let me just sell them just so I can show you guys the example of what I'm trying to put out here. So once everything is, like, in position correct correctly, make sure everything is. Just, like, make sure nothing's off by even a centimeter. And for some reason, guys, it's off. You have to fool your own self too. That's where like that's where I'm coming from. You got to fool your own self too. Yeah, it was off by a centimeter. Now what do you do from here, guys, you may ask? Alright, final task you gotta do. Just like in Among Us. Now you're like, oh, how's that going to reach this, the top? Um, I actually didn't think about that. <laughs> oops. That's a my bad. Oops, bro. Bro, oops. You can probably go to st structural or something. And think of something. Like, I, I don't know what to tell you guys. I will admit, I completely did forget. I would just kind of say at this point, just use your imagination. <gasps> no, how did that even work like that? What? All I did was tap on it and just like somehow even placed it. I thought that was custom mode too. That makes no sense. Well, guys, and there, I guess the only tip I can give you is go to structural or go to like the shapes or whatever. If you're good, you go to structural. This is literally my custom place, man. It's like... This one's... I hate the structural, though. I can't even lie to you guys. I hate it. Structural on this game, it sucks. Wow, everything would have actually looked nice, too. I 
I have actually never did anything like that before. That's actually my first time. Oh yeah, and it looks it looks terrible from a side actually. I guess the next thing you want to do is Since I'm not really good at structural, like I somehow mess it up every time. Maybe I can get better out of it. Maybe I can get better at it over time. But so far, no, I'm like trash at it. But still the structural is like something you can't get better at. It just depends on how your placement is on it and how straight you can actually like go. And for me, it's it's like really hard. On like PC, it's like the easiest thing ever, bro. I swear, for on PC players, they're literally like God to me. I look up to them and I just say, wow, they're God. That's literally what I'm like every day, bro. I'm like, how are these PC get players like God? It's like they can do everything. But then to, to like the PC players, I'm probably like God to them. I'm like, how is he doing, bro? How, how is he doing this? And then some P PC players are going out how to build. They're like, this man's actually really he is God. Now let's see how we can actually do this. It's impossible, I swear, though. Is that going off by a, a centimeter? It's going off by a centimeter because I'm off by a centimeter. Now you now guys, you, you gotta like know something. You can't be off by a single centimeter, bro. Or else you're structurally in, impossible. And what I mean is if you're off by a centimeter, bro. Get caught get caught off by a centimeter. And you're literally building like incorrectly. Like your entire leg building incorrectly. Like don't don't do a crime that terrible. And once again, I'm all I'm all, I'm confused. So do we commit a crime like this? I don't know. Wait, actually, like, I think they're even. No, they weren't. Oh my God, I guess that that can help you guys. I don't, I don't know. I will admit, if you're like really cheap and you want to save money, I don't think this actually saves you money though. I think it's actually the same price. I, I think it does slightly save you money though. But then again, this is more time consuming. I could make more money than I could from this. But I'm just saying, like, like some, like for like some things you like try to save money on. Make sure. You can actually like, like if you can make more money off of doing something, it's like if it's like um like some kind of like building hack that's like really expensive, like if you can make a, a structure, you know what I mean? Like if you can go in decorations and like make a custom decoration, like that's like cheaper, like way cheaper. I'm like I'm talking about like, let's say you're like trying to get a PC or something, and you found like something in decor and like I find a bunch of decoration combos that can like help you make something like that. Or an arcade, then yeah, structurals are like useful for that. But if you can't, then otherwise don't use structural. Because then structurals are just a waste of time and money.